Hello, Quiz Maniacs! Today you will have to guess Wednesday characters without their eyes. Or any facial features at all. Let's see how well you know the show. Let's get started. It's Dr. Valerie Kimbert, but did you know that in the series, Wednesday is forced to go to therapy with sessions with Dr. Valerie Kimbert. When she escapes the first time, audiences can very briefly see a sign that references the showrunners. Miles Miller and Alfred Go, who could not pass up the opportunity to put their names somewhere in the show. It's Wednesday Adams, but did you know that Jenna Ortega showed up to audition covered in blood? While filming for the horror movie X, the actress took a call with Tim Burton to discuss Wednesday. I had stage blood and glycerin sweat in my hair and a massive cut on my face and had been up for over 24 hours, she told Wired. Thing Did you know that Thing was played by a real person, Victor Dorambatu, a magician who wore a full coverage blue suit so that his body could be edited out? Tyler Galpin When Wednesday is talking to Tyler, he informs her that she is just kind of kooky. Wednesday replies that she prefers spooky. This is a nod back to the lyrics of the theme song, they are creepy and they're kooky, mysterious and spooky. Marilyn Thornhill, played by Christina Ricci. It is hard to imagine anyone else playing Nevermore's Normie Teacher, but when filming first began, actress Thora Birch was cast as a similar character, Tamara Novak. When she dropped out, seemingly due to creative differences, Barton created the role of Marilyn Thornhill for Richie. She even had to reshoot some of Birch's scenes using a green screen. Enid Sinclair. To understand her character better, Emma Myers attended a werewolf bootcamp, she told Seventeen. Me and a couple other guys crawling around on the floor, growling at each other. That was weird. I'll never forget that. Principal Weems. Principal Weems' outfits were inspired by a Hitchcock film. Tisha Adams. Catherine Zeta Jones spent the longest time in hair and makeup. We worked together to create this modern Morticia, had makeup and hair designer Tara McDonald told BuzzFeed. From her hair extensions to covering her body in pale foundation, and the transformation took about two and a half hours. Gomez Adams. Did you know that Luis Guzman is the oldest Gomez Adams to date? Xavier Ford. Percy Hines White was the cast's biggest prankster, the actor who played Xavier Thorpe's most memorable gag. He stole a golf cart from set. He and Georgie Farmer, Ajax, got in trouble after being chased down the street by crew members. Lurch. The actor who played Lurch, George Burkea, is the shortest Lurch in Adam's family history. He's only six foot three. Bianca Barkley. Joy Sunday was freaked out by her bright contact lenses at first. Looking in the mirror versus seeing myself on screen is a little crazy, she told Teen Vogue. Uncle Fester. Fred Armisen really shaped his head to play Uncle Fester. What a commitment to the role. Ajax The actor who played Ajax grew so fond of Percy Hines White, Xavier, that they became roommates in LA after returning home from set. Puxley but did you know that Pugsley was originally going to be named Pubert? Joseph Braxton 
Did you know that the scene of Craxton Resurrection is a direct reference to Frankenstein by Mary Shelley's? Donovan Galpin Did you know that his wife was a Hyde, and although he suspected his son to inherit this teacher, he was reluctant to admit it? Eugene Ottinger Character of Eugene is a reference to an old Adams Family 2 movie. Eugene's appearance is influenced by Joel Glicker from the aforementioned movie. Like Joel, he wears glasses and happens to sport a similar hairstyle. How many did you get? And did you like this one? If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. Toodaloo, quiz maniacs!